Right here, I've got a copper cube in it, and I've also got a zinc cube as well, and we're going to use them to make some brass in it. This is what brass looks like still, golding and that. Ah, right, cool. So obviously we're going to have to melt them in a the furnace, isn't it? So we're going to slap the copper in there and the little zinc cubes as well. You're done, no? Man's got a water pump there. Keep the machine cool and that. Ah, right, cool. Let's heat it up now, yeah? So obviously copper metal has a melting point of 1000 degrees Celsius, isn't it? But zinc melts at only 400 degrees. So obviously that's why the zinc's melting bare quick and that. Also, zinc boils at only 900 degrees Celsius. So it's going to turn into a gas before the copper even gets a chance to turn into a liquid yet. It's a mad thing, cuz. Man just slapped a little aluminium foil in there as well, car. Why not, innit? You see all them yellow and white strands, yeah? That's zinc oxide, because obviously the zinc's reacting with the oxygen in the air, innit? Mad thing. Alright, cool. So now, we're going to take the brass out of the furnace and then pour it up. You know what I'm saying, fam? Look at that, man. Orange settings and that. Alright, cool. So what we're going to do now is something called quenching, innit? And that's when you rapidly cool the metal down in some water. And that makes it 